So I'm very interested to see how. Um... By the way, uh, is uh, do you know which is which between Camex and Dark Blue? Camex is almost definitely Sonic. <laughs> All right. So yeah, we're gonna be seeing how Dark Blue is able to deal with the oppression of Sonic. All right. Already getting things started. Good parry so far. Already kind of catching Kamek's rhythm. All right. I like the movement off the platform using the, the blaster. Dark Blue is catching Kamek's, uh, narrowing out of combos quite a bit. All right, the Sonic Classic. Up be at a disadvantage. All right, now we're seeing Kamek's getting started with some Sonic combos here. Just Ooh, okay, okay. Hitting the F smash, getting Kamex off stage. F smash actually gonna catch that down B and uh, back air gonna catch uh Kamex's coming down with I think that was Nair. I'll be with you real quick. <laughs> Just no tweet worries. out this match. No worries. So now this is where Sonic can kind of struggle a bit, is when he's behind, he needs to find that kill. Uh, typically, Sonic is great when he can lay on the pressure and make the opponent do something that they shouldn't be. All right, let's see how this is going. So yeah, so so far Dark Blues, well, was with a stock lead, but Kamek's bringing it back. Uh, not too much of a deficit. Uh, that d Definitely a percent that solidifies the lead, but he's already closing that gap really well, really quickly and efficiently. Already taking, like, was maintaining center. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Tried to mix up the timing, but Dark Blues is ready with the back air. Yep. Uh, the big toe going to send him right off the side. So now Dark Blues once again with a stock lead. Uh, and right now, th not really facing any potential death. Uh, so it's kind of in a safe spot. Uh, we'll have to see how he can deal with recovering here. All right, does pretty good. Yeah, I think uh, Kamex. Oh wow, Kamex has been uh, pressing buttons quite a bit out of his disadvantage state, and Dark Blue, you know, Wolf's got those big buttons. He's, you know, he can he can deal with those. Yeah, really caught him. Let's see how that looked again. Oh yeah. wow, he was trying to fight his way out with the fair. Okay, I think I only caught two of the replays. Ooh, let's See, this is the, the first stock. Okay, let's see what happened there. Mm -hmm. So I think probably mm. if I could pick one thing to uh, improve on for Camex is um, probably just mixing up his landings when he's being juggled by Wolf. Yeah, uh, Wolf controls like a lot of space like uh, around him, and he's got those, those really good buttons, uh, you know, so you just kind of try and need to stay out of that. Uh, and just kind of like put him, really strain him for what he wants to get. Mm -hmm. uh, all right. There we go. Homing attack sometimes, you know, has that really unfortunate miss. Once again, tried to mix up his uh, recovery with the, I think it was Whoa. side B to down B. Yeah, we're, we're trying to punish all the smash attacks with smash attacks, and everyone is whiffing. <laughs> okay. Wolf and Nair doing such a good job of mm -hmm. keeping uh, keeping Kamex away. Great job by Kamex by uh, re reacting to that uh, the air dodge, putting him off stage, and then putting him in a real precarious situation. Able to forward smash him off the ledge. Mm -hmm. So now Kamex, uh, I think for the first time uh, in the lead, by a stock. That is correct. Already getting a quick 30% Sonic combo, and this is where Sonic loves to be. And I, we haven't even talked about the counter pick yet in uh, Town and City, just giving Kamek so much room to run around and get back aired. Yeah, uh, just for reference, uh, Dark Blues' uh, bands were Lila and Yoshi's. I'm not really sure how uh, useful those are versus Sonic. Uh, but yeah, uh, leaving Town City open, a uh, very wide stage, something that uh, Sonic uh, kind of likes, with close sides, uh, the blast zone to ledge ratio compared to other stages. So oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, but yeah, uh, Dark Blue was able to even out the stocks, but ooh, ooh, oh ooh. my, wow, okay. He had the read, but didn't pull the trigger quite fast enough. All right, I like that uh, homing attack to get himself out, and just like you said, those close blast zones gonna be giving Kamex that kill. Yep, 
All right, so now we have a full. St well, okay. Uh, honestly, the while Chemix is in the lead, uh, percents are getting a little bit up there. So it, right now, uh, Chemix needs to attack on as much percent as possible uh, to really solidify this lead, especially because because you know. Uh, Wolf's edge guarding is so strong. You know he, he has a lot of options to like go for two frames and stuff like that. Uh, like he's going for those uh, forward tilts. But oh my god, the homing <laughs> attacks! He is here. Target locked on. Uh, All right, there we go. Yep, didn't jump out of uh, the side B. Uh, uh, it was a down B. Down B. Okay, and uh, yeah, took the took the football kick, and it's good. All right. Dark Blues at the edge again. Ooh, that could have been a big back air. Yeah, nice uh, lingering nair to really just cover the whole spot, covering jump uh, and normal get up uh, in that good timing and all that. That oh, should this, be this, it. Yeah. Yep. All right. Yeah, no, Kamex was doing a great job of keeping Dark Blues in the corner there, uh, especially with the homing attack. Homing attack just lets you control so much space, especially when your opponent wants to, say, jump out of the, out of the corner. All right, let's let's see the whole thing because once he, once he got hit by that, that's like I'm pretty sure essentially just a hit confirm. I'm pretty sure, yeah. Yeah. So, oh wait, did he? Hold on. Did he mean to? He was already facing that direction. He, I think he. No, he just turned it around. Ooh. That's oh unfortunate. Um, I think that was just a misinput. Anyway. Probably. We're, yep. Going to game three, and we're going to PS2. Running it back. Yep. Uh, for reference, Kamex's bands were Battlefield and Town and City. Oh, no, Smashville, sorry. Yeah, Battlefield and Smashville. Oh, uh, it makes sense. Um, well, hmm. Sonic is a character that can keep away, but uh, I can kind of see, like, Smashville definitely. <laughs> if, if you can't get away from Wolf, like, good lord. Yeah, I'm surprised uh, Small Battlefield was chosen over PS2. Or, I mean, uh, other way Vice around. versa, yeah. yeah. Um, you know, sometimes it's just like a nice comfort. It's just like already, already had the data that he wound in there and uh, just going back to it. But now we see, you know, Kamex has made, uh, so far, all the necessary adjustments. Once again, taking the first stock uh, and now has a pretty solid lead. 80, 80 damage means, like, you're not at kill percent <laughs> is what I would say yeah. <laughs> until you eat a wolf back air off the side, especially on PS2, which has uh, close uh, side blast zones to ledge ratio compared to the others. All right, nice Wolf Blaster shutting down those approaches. Uh, Sonic up air is a finished product. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh my god, going right through the, the blaster. Ooh. Finished product. Yeah. <laughs> ooh, okay, I like the double spring action. Yep, uh, always remember that like when Sonic does uh, down air, uh, it actually has a, it, it ends pretty quickly so he enters a normal state uh, so he can land with a regular landing lag yeah especially uh, when Sonic sees the spring to get up high they can uh, yep. land pretty comfortably yeah no hero landing you know <laughs> no, uh, superhero landing not to be confused with hero um, yeah ooh reading the jump and almost taking it great uh, DI by Dark Blues yeah going right into the corner great job mm. so now like you know, just as we saw, like, when I was saying, he was at least percents where he died. So, like, it's definitely possible uh, for uh, Dark Blues to turn this around, turn this uh, percent deficit into a stock lead, potentially. Oh, my God. Did he hold down to... I think so, yeah. Yeah, he had to have, right? Ooh. All right, Did he hold go. down there? No. Uh, maybe? Maybe. That I looked like a... That looked really late for yeah. the two frames. Yeah, okay, cool. All right, I'm not, I'm not imagining it. So, yeah. Yeah. All right, so Kamex, uh, with a decent, an okay lead, because like we said, we, we saw him die. Uh, yeah, this is about where we <laughs> saw him die last stock. Down B actually going under the blaster. I don't know if we've seen that previously. I thought blaster caught the down B. Okay, uh, Dark was being a little bit, uh, I don't know, um, too aggressive? I don't know. He's just really trying to stuff everything uh, Kamex is throwing at him. Yeah, no, Kamex is already just about lapping Dark Blues in percent. This is looking pretty rough for Dark Blues right now. Yeah, but, I mean, this is the, the Sonic special, right? Sonic with the lead so hard to uh, to make a comeback against. Ooh. Well, not if you accidentally homing attack the ground. Yes. Uh, Kamex almost dying off the top, but, all right. There gonna, we go. All right, going to get the forward tilt off the side, 140. So already knocking on Death's door, and there we Death go. is 
answering. Tank's going to be taking it 2 1 over Dark Blues. Moving on uh, in the winner's side. So, yeah. Yeah, great showing from both players. Uh, I really loved seeing Kamex's uh, adaptations. Uh, like we were saying after game one, he made those adjustments, crunched the numbers, got the timings that he needed, and Dark Blues just wasn't quite ready for it. Yeah. And I think we saw even near the end, um, Dark Blues was swinging pretty hard for that. Okay, uh, I, I want to see this. Oh, okay, <gasps> yeah. I think he did too. He absolutely... Did he? Look. And... He, he did. He, he's in two frame, but I, I'm pretty sure he still did hold it. That's the yeah. funny thing. I'm pretty sure he did hold it because uh, it just took so long. Yeah. But uh, interesting. Okay. Uh, yeah. All right. So the next match we're going to be seeing is going to be uh, Sinji versus Sonic Fiend. Yo, thanks, Black Sheep, for the subscription. Let's also go. Sending the camera over to you. Hello. Hello. I'm back.